A series of doctor's appointments and procedures sparked a realization that patients need to feel protected and covered in waiting rooms. Lauren Orlick and Sarah Dorband, the co-founders of Heart Snug, are helping women everywhere feel less vulnerable and more confident, and they join us now. Ladies, thank you so much for joining us here on Live in the Bay. Thank you so much for providing us the opportunity to share our mission-driven business, Heart Snug. Yes, of course. Now, there's only two of you here today, but you're actually a trio, correct? We sure are. My sister, Lisa. <laughs> Uh -huh. um, is also a co-founder. Wonderful. Well, let's get into Heart Snug. And for our viewers who may not understand, what exactly is it? So Heart Snug is a medical support bra, mm -hmm. and it's disposable. And the goal is to provide patient privacy. Mm -hmm. And when did you ladies first discover that this was a need in the medical field? Okay, so... I grew up, um, I actually, I was born with a very complex heart defect mm -hmm. and I had open heart surgery at my beloved UCSF hospital as a baby. So naturally growing up with a chronic condition, I was in and out of a lot of doctor's appointments, procedures, um, participated in a lot of heart um, research studies. And in particular, when I was 15 or 16 years old, I remember feeling really vulnerable and insecure uh, with all the chest exposure. Mm -hmm. And especially back then, you know, 30 years ago, uh, cardiology was a male dominated field. Mm -hmm. uh, so I really had wished that there was an extra layer um, to provide for privacy yeah. and comfort. Um, so fast forward, I am doing great now, but I have had two TIAs, which are mini strokes, and also I had um, a larger stroke five years ago. Landed me back in the hospital, um, had other surgeries, and in that moment I realized um, I really wanted to empower the patient experience mm -hmm. um, and you can give back. And so it was an aha moment. And so I called my best friend, childhood best friend Lauren and my sister Lisa. <laughs> and I said, yeah. you know what? Let's create a disposable medical bra. Mm -hmm. And I had gone through, my mom had gone through a cancer three years ago and watching her really go in and out of appointments, whether it was through chemo, radiation, and just, you know, wheeling her wheelchair down the aisle and just adjusting the gown. You know, we really, like Sarah said, it was an aha moment. You know, in 2022, almost 2023, mm -hmm. medical gowns and garments are really around just the gown. And so we wanted to provide, we actually, after that call, we drew it on a piece of paper and really a year and a half later have made it come to light. And we've had amazing support from wow. medical clinics to hospitals to women's shelters, IVF clinics. I mean, you name it from mm -hmm. teen to geriatric care. We are really getting amazing support from the community as well as across the country to yep. get heart mm -hmm. snug in as many patients' hands as we can. That's absolutely wonderful. An incredible product. And I can Thank really you. truly see um, that this was needed, like you said, in the medical industry because so many women could use a product like this. And go ahead. Absolutely. For example, um, gosh, just last week, I ended up in the ER with chest pains and I had heart snug. And firsthand, my, I really saw the impact. I wore it, you know, throughout all these different appointments. And something to note, there's no metal. Mm -hmm. So well, it, I was going to ask you, how yeah. does it work? It's x-ray safe it's x -ray material. Safe. Oh, wow. So okay. when you're going in for radiation or chemo, you will get this, or an MRI or an x-ray, you'll get the same results that, you know, that you mm. would have yeah. without. So you can stay covered yeah. and protected Absolutely. the whole time. And Correct. more dignified from a mental and physical element. Yeah. yeah, there's a huge, research shows us, and just from mm -hmm. common sense, there's a huge psychological impact mm -hmm. uh, to wearing the medical gown, um, in particular for those that are living with a chronic condition. Mm -hmm. um, it really can make you feel vulnerable and sick. Yeah. So we and, want to change that narrative. And listen, it's not, some people don't have exposure, you know, for issues, but we definitely want to be able to have the option and the choice be with the patient. Yeah. That it's, you know, they're given an option to have heart snug in addition to the gown. Yeah. And it is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. October oh, is, yes. is the month for that. Yeah. Now, when women are going to get mammograms, stuff like that, can they wear heart snug? Absolutely. We, yeah. yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. That's what we're hoping and getting the education and awareness out there in our bra and as many you know, medical hospitals, clinics, mm -hmm. patients as we can. Wonderful. Well, ladies, thank you so much for joining us here on Live in the Bay. We appreciate it so much and for giving us some insight into Heart Snug. 
Thank you, you for so having much. us. Yeah. Thank you. To learn more about Heart Snug, we'll have a link on our website at liveinthebay.tv.